We left off at a pretty critical point where Hwang Dong Suk and his party is trying to scam us. That's right. We got Lil Bro funded by Daddy's credit card protecting us against the spider. Because if we die while they're getting their pickaxes because they forgot to fucking get their stuff, then they could collect all the loot. But here's what I'm thinking. I say we kill that spider and wait for them to come back. And then we kill them. And then we loot everything and leave. Let's begin today's reaction. These goons, man. You know what? I can't even hate on them. I, I honestly, like, if this was a game, I'm not gonna lie. I've done some scummy shit too for my own gains. No, you couldn't. Oh, All for the money. <laughs> you would be right, but our man is leveling up. All they gotta do is just wait it out. Yeah, his gear, what about it? Funded by daddy's credit card. Oh, they're thinking about looting the kid too. Oh my god. I didn't even go beyond. Holy shit. I didn't even think about the possibility that they were eyeing his gear to loot that kid too. That is fucked. Dude, his voice is so different now. I'm not crazy, right? Like, I'm not insane, right? Like, his voice just sounds so much more bass boosted now. I swear to God, they fucking increased the bass. Like, it is so deeper. Alright, but this one's C rank, right? It's fine, you got the new dagger, dude. Uh huh. Uh -huh. He's smiling in the face of difficulty. Is he done? No, 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 shall we one shot it, right? Ooh. Opening! Oh, I'm so good with this shit! I'm so good with this shit! Here we go, spider fight! It's pretty hard. Can't break the shell. Really? One shot and we're dead, really? What is daddy's credit card thinking right now? Gino's probably like, shit. I just told Big Bro that I'd protect him, but I didn't know he was built like this. That's right! Ain't no way he's E rank now! Probably like D, like D to C rank. He's kind of in like level 18. What does that really mean? Like D to C rank level? I don't know. Shee look at this. Look at that. Wait, rare individuals that can control their magic power. People intentionally smurf. Now we know that Sung Jimu didn't do that. But there exist hunters that intentionally nerf themselves so they can smurf around in low rank dungeon. What? <laughs> Lunatics who kill for it. I mean, he does look pretty fucking murderous. Like, Sungjin with new eyes right now. Like, look, like, <laughs> he does look pretty evil. Yo, what are you doing here, Jinho? Come on. Daddy's credit card is not gonna save you right now. What do we do then? I fucking hate fatigue in any game system. Tongue, go for the tongue. Go for the eyes. Poison! Acid. Eight legged freak, he's being so mean to the spider, man. Wakaba wouldn't enjoy this. <laughs> wow, I, I wonder what this new skill dash does. Speed 30%. Wow, okay. Damn, okay. Okay, you know, I, okay, okay, okay. I was just shitting on the skill dash for being so basic, but this animation is kind of nuts. Look at this. Look at this wind effect. What? Dash always oh, this cool? In any game? What the fuck? I can hear the voice acting, guys. Yes, the voice acting is amazing. Damn, he's so fast. Looks like he's teleporting. Dude, you can... Oh, wait. Fatigue, no! 
Oh, you said one shot and it's over. It wasn't a lethal puncture, but ooh. <laughs> Shinho! Armor! Come on! Use daddy's credit card! What? Oh! Wait, 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 wait. Daily quest reward that he didn't pick up yet because you can, like, take it at different times. He never... What the f... You, you just got a date... You can literally just save this shit up. So you should never use full recovery immediately. You just fucking save it. Just, just why not? It's extra insurance, bro. He's gaming. <gasps> this dude. Does it stack up? I wonder. On like next day, does it keep resetting? Uh, who knows? Surely this one will work. Yeah, we got in. Okay, paralysis effect is on now. Right? Debuff. Yeah, paralysis is on. Dude, his eyes keep glowing. Is this just artistic effect? Are, are they just trying to go with the aesthetic design of this? Or is this actually important? Like, wh what does his eyes mean? Who knows? <laughs> so it doesn't keep stacking? <laughs> you know, what was this? Was that like 3% or 1% like HP drain? Sort of thing? But if you keep doing this, that just, just keeps stacking? Instead of one diva fall, that's like fucking 100 times diva fall. We're done? You have defeated the master of the- I mean, okay, first of all, I never was too hyped about the spider fight because like, yeah, this the spider fight's gonna be, like, it is a boss fight, but at the end of the day, like, no one really was too hyped for the spider fight. Like, no one actually thought that Jin would struggle. Now, the good shit is <laughs> the Huang Dong Soup party coming in, right? Them coming in to see the whole shit, we're still alive. <laughs> Yeah, I wonder if full recovery could carry on to the next day, though. You know what I mean? <laughs> Jino didn't do anything. Yes. Not really. But I could definitely see why you would think that. Boss? <laughs> he called him Aniki, dude. <laughs> he totally changed. Aniki? Big boss? Okay, what's up? This kid is very fast. His his thinking, the brain processing speed, like he's a good kid. And yes, he's got daddy's credit card buying him all this cool shit. Doesn't mean he's a spoiled little brat, but he's very quick at that. Bro immediately realized the amazing, you know, potential of Sung Jin Moon. He's like, shit, I gotta fucking submit right now. If I can be his right hand man right now in the early stages where he hasn't really developed just yet, ooh, could you can, could you think about the future, right? Here's some water too, boss. Aniki. <laughs> Bro is fucking looting all the mana stones now. <laughs> Immediately gives him water. I'm on it, boss. You got it. He's great. You rizzed him up, Jungwoo. Your powers are so cool. Here we go. What are you smiling at, dumbass? <laughs> These dudes. Oh, this gonna be good. This gonna be good. They should be fucking... Wait, wouldn't they be like shocked? Why are they smiling? I guess they're smiling because we took out the spider and they feel like they can loot it for free, but they don't realize though, like, you think Jin Moose just gonna let you go? There's no way we're just gonna let him do that, right? No fucking shot. Oh! oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Wait, dude! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Old man! You see the old man animation? Oh! Oh! Dude, fucking rope! Yo! He flexed his arm and his fucking sleeve exploded! Look at this! Oh! He even has a cut on the back of his neck like he's a motherfucking titan! Why do you have all these scars? Who are you, old man? This Gramps is cracked! He's so humble too! Look at this shit! I need to see some backstory. I need to see a prime elder, whatever his name is, bro. This this guy is Elder Go, I think. This guy needs to fucking... I need to see what he was like in the past, bro. Go Gun He is his name? Okay. Mm. It's at times like those when human nature can rear its ugly head. Everything for the sake of profit. Would they be willing to kill each other? People's true natures are finally gonna show. Mask off moments. Mm. They think that the boss is fucking weak because we defeated it, huh? 
Yeah. Cause that guy wants our fucking gear too, right? He wants to loot us. Your old man, Yu Myung Han, head of the Eugene Construct. So he is like the fucking like Kong. So his dad owns like a construction company. Okay, he's like super loaded. Okay, makes sense. They did background check on us, huh? You kill Song Do you think little bro Jin Ho's gonna betray us after he just said, Adi Ki, here's some water for you? Nah, he ain't gonna betray us. This kid's too good. Nah, uh uh, uh uh, uh uh. Okay, mask off! Every, the, the, the truth is out! Are you sure that's the only way you're walking out alive? Because I can think of another way of walking out alive. And it's by murking you motherfuckers. Why do you need to live, huh? What if we just kill you? Take all the mana stones and say, Oh, shit happened in the labyrinth. I don't know that the spider killed them all. We were lucky to get out alive thanks to their sacrifice. He still thinks that Jin Ho did it, huh? Okay. He still thinks that the gear did it. They're actually gonna try? Nothing ever happening here is gonna get out, bro. Oh my god, it's gonna be good. Nah, I don't think he'll ever betray us. He won't. Watch! He's gonna get in front of Jin Ho and say, Step back, big bro. I got you. Just like how he said against the spider. This kid is a good kid. I trust him. Trust him. He's got a good heart. <laughs> That's right! That's right! That's our boy! Now you die. Now you die. Oh. Not yet. But we're about to have their virginity lifted. Thank you, Mr. Hwang Dong Suk. And look at them. They got their fucking red eyes coming out. Oh, they have no clue. But that's true. Have you ever killed a human before? We haven't really crossed that bridge, huh? Some people are so, like, like different isekai shows and different, like, fantasy shows, there, it, it's, like, almost like a rite of passage to, like, cross that bridge. It's almost, like, irreversible, you know what I mean? So, like, this could be the defining moment of Sung Jimu's character because any news and all these different essay, video essay channels that we've been watching on Soul Loving that's been saying about how his development into this cold, ruthless being is, is, is showed, right? So, like, this could be the moment. Kill him. And, er, wait, 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 wait. What was the quest panel? What was the quest panel? Notification. An urgent quest has arrived. Cause, cause we're a player. Urgent quest. Defeat the enemies. Goal. There are people present who want to kill the player. Player Jin Mu. Defeat them all and ensure your safety. Warning. If you do not complete this quest. You will receive an appropriate penalty. Last time about that appropriate penalty, we failed the daily quest and we had to be summoned to that fucking desert land to fight the centipede things, right? So we gotta actually kill him. I mean, look, 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 look. I don't think Jin Moon necessarily wants to kill him right now, right? But the system is telling us to kill him, right? So it's like, it's not our fault. It's, it's I mean, the game's telling us, man. Now nah, we good, we good, we good, right? Right, right, right? Oh, 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 oh. Am, am I underestimating them? Am, 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 oh, okay, Jin Mu's dead, roll credits, thanks for the, okay, that's not the reaction, right? Come, come. Who is this girl? Is this the nurse? This is not Jin, huh? Our little sister. Is this the nurse? Who's the, who the, who are these characters? <laughs> Tiger. Oh, that's the guy that we saw with the other guy with them. With the huge abs that was like turning into a beast, right? The S-class S hero guy, hunter guy. What the fuck are we doing right now? This is... Okay. Oh, this, this blonde orange haired girl is with Cha Hyeyeon? They're actually really important. Dude, they're... <laughs> I feel like sometimes the camera guy, the camera guy, especially in the solo leveling trailer, right? They, they really know, they put a lot of attention and detail into Chai in scenes. And again, is this anime only? This is probably anime only, right? Was this shown in the webtoon? Because 
I feel like the anime keeps up hyping up this character because people are saying this character doesn't even show up for the future. So they just keep showing it, sprinkling in, just hyping anime only saying, hey guys, this girl might not show up in season one, but we will hype her up just for you guys so that you can kind of anticipate for the future. She's so cool. So these characters are not NPCs. They're part of Chaiyan's part. They're pretty, they're pretty fucking strong. They these girls are probably some of the strongest hunters we've seen so far, honestly. Straight up. This table of hunters is probably stronger than Huang Dong-suk's party. Chol? Who is he? Right, there's like five guilds in Korea, and Mr. Fucking Guild Leader Che literally named his guild the Hunter's Guild. The fucking arrogance. But it's genius branding, so that people just think that by default that that is the only guild. But five major guilds, right? Like, these are the big guilds, right? There's like a little, like... Pretty much, this is like Amazon, Microsoft, Google, you know, fucking Facebook, stuff like that, right? It's like, it's like the big companies. Huh? High fatality rates. You mean intentionally calling people off for loot and Sung Jimu is still down. Holy shit. Is he dead, guys? Jinwoo looks pretty... Guys, guy, I think he's actually... He's not dead, but it's looking pretty bad. What are you doing, bro? Wait, wait, wait. Let him cook. Main character monologue time. That's right. They betrayed you, remember? Oh, he's, he's, fucking, he's fucking losing it. Uh-oh. He's changing. Something is snapping in his brain. Hold up. Yes. Fall to the dark side. Yes. It's mutual benefit. The better... Exactly. The more Sun Jin Woo becomes stronger and survives for the sake of the system, the better it is for the system. But what exactly is that, right? Oh, shit. He's up. Oh shit, he's up. Kill him. Kill him all! Kill him all! Time to kill him, come on. Let's go, let's go! Okay. <laughs> Do you, if they could actually hear what Sung Jimu's saying right now, they probably think that he's fucking, fucking crazy. System, what are you talking about? <laughs> Who's he talking to? <laughs> yeah. Do they understand? Oh, what is that aura? Look at the dark aura here. Again, when his eyes are glowing, when he got the fucking purple blue aura around him when fighting Kasuka, now too. Oh, thumbnail! Thumbnail! If you're gonna kill, you better ready to be killed yourselves. Man. Look, buddy, you clearly don't understand what's going on here. He's going to die. How dare you touch him like that? First death? First death? Ah! Okay, the bridge is crossed. Have you ever killed before? Yeah, we have. Rip Bozo. That's number one. Five more to go. Uh-huh. Dude, he's doing this so casually. Maybe he's not an E-rank, Mr. Huang dong Su. Huh? Is he gonna mentally collapse? But they deserve it. Exactly. We did it for survival. <laughs> then I will be the strongest. Nothing personal, kid. That's three! Paralysis! Oh! Oh! That's the effect of the knife on humans? Five! Yo! He's like, I feel actually scared. Did you see his eyes there? Look at this shit! Oh! Dude, if I was like, oh my god, if I was gonna get them, this is actually fucking terrifying, dude. He's the actual villain! <laughs> Y'all asked for it! Shinho, close your eyes, you don't want to see this! Stronger now than when he was fighting the dungeon, but even stronger, because probably, I don't know, emotional response. You next! Oh, Mr. Siren! 
Oh, that's where you're wrong, bro. He leveled up. He is so fast there, though. Holy shit. Anime rules. Never monologue and talk about how an enemy can't do something. My skin is strong, reinforced, right? It's like, you won't be able to, you know, break my armor? Come on. <laughs> Remember that guy? I'm confident in my speed. Just fucking gets your foot cut off. <laughs> Dumbass. You should have never said that. Oh, he's so fast! Yo! The same crew of the soundtrack! Ooh. Yeah, he has been. He's probably C rank now, right? I don't know! <laughs> Please don't kill me! I can shoot you! I can pay you! Shut the fuck up! You know how I'm getting paid? I'm gonna kill you and take all the mana crystals here! A billion ones worth! Uh-uh! You're gonna die! I'm gonna, I'm gonna loot you too! Fuck your gear! I'm gonna loot you too! Just like how you said you're gonna loot Jin Ho! <laughs> Little too late! Oh, we're gonna get away with it. Don't you worry. <laughs> what happens in the dungeon stays in the dungeon, right? That's what you said! Get the fuck out of my face! And look, okay, hold on, 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 hold on. This is an important line, right? This is a super important line. You little shit! Do you have any idea who my brother? Remember, little bro might be a fucking S rank hunter. You don't know, because this is now gonna lead into the next arc. Will the little bro actually want revenge? But the big bro and the little bro, apparently, they kind of hate each other based on the way they were talking last episode, right? You never know. <laughs> No, who? Who are you? Who are you or your little bro? Sad. Pathetic. And now, quest to feed. Okay, do we get a reward? Oh, the boss is dead. So then he's closed. Let's get out of here. He's so casual with it right now. <laughs> like, you just killed six people. Jinho is puking on the fucking ground. And also, what about the mana crystals? We can't collect it? No, 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 it's okay, it's okay. You, you, you guys are being too uh, tunnel vision right now. Because what you guys think is that, oh no, we just lost the mana crystals. But what I'm thinking is, we've just got access to daddy's credit card by becoming his boss. So I think that this relationship being secured is better than the mana crystals at the end of it. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Shit, that shit went down. It was dangerous in there. I, I, I don't know. I just, I passed out. I passed out. Oh, oh it's the pay to win gear. His daddy's credit card weapons. Gotcha. Maya Company's Kalyan Longsword. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. What did we get? Wait, wait, wait. That's skill there. Hold up. Quest rewards. You got rewards. Full recovery, ability points plus 10, but most importantly, skill murderous intent because we killed now we have murderous what is this like a way to like intimidate other people by like showing them our presence of killing intent what is that okay. panic oh it's a detail oh it's a debuff minus 50 percent stat on everything so you literally it's like intimidate you literally intimidate them with murderous intent, minus 50% on all abilities on the enemy. What the fuck? I mean, wait, wait, the MP one. Is this magic finally? Because you know how we didn't use any of our stats into int yet? But now, look at this, MP cost 100. Finally, we're getting like, now we need to actually put some skills into fucking int now, don't we? Yeah, we need mana now. Yeah, just ignore the blood on his fucking jacket and the and the lack of any cuts on the fucking armor. But yes, that's what happens, sure. Uh, yeah. All right, sure, guild girl. Bye bye. We got away with it though. We got away with it. Please don't kill me, Aniki. Please, I swear allegiance to you. Rain. Juhi? Did we do that? Sister? Oh, not Juhi. Fuck Juhi. Little sister. <laughs> what the fuck? God damn! Wait. Wait. You think that 
Is this the little bro? No. Is this the little bro, Huang Tong Su? Wait, wait, wait. What do you mean? That's a cliffhanger! What? <laughs> All right. That's the episode. Fucking. It, 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 you couldn't just like say something at the end and say, like, hmm, so I see my big brother is dead. But it just fucking shows this dude just in his boxers, just looking at the window. Fucking troll, dude. Fucking troll. But hey, that is the episode. Damn. This episode was fucking cold. Now, again, the spider fight at the end of the day, not that important, right? It's cool to see some Jimu go crazy like this, use his new knife and other stuff like that. Yeah, it's cool. But what we all wanted was what's going to happen when the spider is down and Hwang Dong Suk's party comes back, right? What's going to happen? Also, there was a lot of cool Chairman Go Kun Hee scenes that apparently wasn't in the webtoon, but more anime only dubs, right? Him being introduced like this and Cha Hae-in being introduced like this in the anime like that. I think it's a great way to hype up these characters that otherwise wouldn't have been shown or known if you're only anime only. You know what I mean? Because these are like late game webtoon characters apparently. And damn, the system told us that we need to kill six people. So if we're in danger, the system's incentive is to keep us alive because we're so important to the system. Why does the system need us as the player? It's almost as if courage of the weak, the system has been waiting for like an appropriate candidate to finally, I don't know, uh, it's almost like it's the system's player and the better that the player does, the system will also be rewarded. But I don't know what that is, right? We don't know exactly why the system needs Sung Jin Woo around, but maybe somehow it's some kind of, again, it is a game. And like the fact that like the system has his own player and maybe there's like other players around and maybe whoever can get the most points for the players by defeating all these different gates and monsters. I don't fucking know. I'm just trying to theorize. I, I, I don't fucking know. This is like really this end game content, but we did get a fucking new skill out of this. We have to kill six people. He's so cold. He kills them all so brutally. He even like has like a moment of like realization that, oh, I finally killed. I actually killed and And he didn't seem to have a normal reaction because he's been betrayed so much. I think it, I think it's justified how he wasn't like a pussy. You know, some characters, when they kill for the first time in Isekai or their fantasy shows, they have this like realization, they start throwing up. And I think that's like a very normal reaction. But because of what Sung Jin Moo has been gone through and the fact that he was thinking, all oh, right, betrayal, violence, it is survival at the end of the day, right? It's survival of the fittest. So I think it makes perfect sense how he was able to overcome that, become so cold and ruthless. He just cuts off that guy's head. And he's like, oh, he died. That's it. That's what happens, bro. Fuck, you're gonna try to kill me? I'm gonna kill you. And I think that's totally justified. We're starting to see, like, it's only episode six. And, like, the inner psyches of this character has completely changed. Not just the physique. Yes, he's got another plastic surgery. He looks fucking great. He's getting new clothes. But even his mentality, the way he thinks, it's becoming more and more cold. And I'm sure he's gonna continue to become more ruthless and more cold, right? This scene was so fucking cool. But I wonder if there's ever gonna come to a point where he starts to get out of control and he, he like, loses it. You know what I mean? To the point where he doesn't know, he, he loses his like sense of humanity. And at that point, do you think that a certain girl's gonna save him? It's not gonna be Ju Hee. <laughs> Maybe Cha Hae I don't know. Usually in these kind of cliches, there needs to be like a sister or like a loved one that keeps him grounded, you know? So it's definitely not gonna be Ju Hee though, cause she is power crept. But that's it from me, if you're still here. If you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.